April Fools! So the question is, as believers, should we celebrate April Fool's Day? The origins of April Fool's Day are actually in some debate. The earliest recorded April Fool's Day celebration appears to be in the 1600s in Germany. But its origins go much further back than that. The most commonly accepted origin of April Fool's Day is actually in the 1500s when we switched from the Julian to the Gregorian calendar. God's biblical new year is actually in the spring, and most of the world celebrated the spring new years until the Gregorian calendar switch. That's about the time the world elites decided they didn't want to celebrate a biblical new year. They wanted to celebrate it at the same time they worshipped their gods during the winter solstice. And the story goes that when they switched the New Year's from spring to winter, the people that decided to disregard this calendar change and still celebrate the New Year in springtime were labeled as fools. In this particular article, the author noted that the Jews and Muslims do not celebrate April Fool's Day, but that the Catholic Church has no problem with the celebration. I don't know about you guys, but if the Catholic Church is okay with something, it's probably not biblical. Even though the roots of April Fool's Day may not be known precisely, the evidence strongly indicates that it is a pagan origin and that it was even celebrated as part of pagan worship services. So with that in mind, as a believer, what does it say in the Bible about this? Ephesians 5, let there be no filthiness, nor foolish talk, nor crude joking, which are out of place, but instead let there be thanksgiving. Jeremiah 10, learn not the ways of the nations. Proverbs 10, doing wickedness is like a sport to a fool. Proverbs 26, like a madman who throws firebrands, arrows, and death is a man who deceives his neighbor and says, I am only joking. Sounds an awful lot like April Fool's Day to me. And I know most people don't associate April Fool's Day as a Christian holiday. However, whenever we're talking about celebrating holidays of the world, it's always good to consider what was said in Deuteronomy 12. Take care that you be not ensnared to follow them after they have been destroyed before you, and that you do not inquire about their gods, saying, How did these nations serve their gods, that I also may do the same? You shall not worship the Lord your God in that way. For every abominable thing that the Lord hates, they have done for their gods. For they even burn their sons and daughters in the fire of their gods. Everything that I command you, you shall be careful to do. You shall not add or take away from it. As a believer, the evidence seems to be indicating that we should not observe this day. But with all things, exercise discernment when making your choice.